into part way into 2014 Dodge 2500 Laramie. It came in when it came in. One of these bolts was backed out and it broke off, and a piece of it was up in the crush sleeve area in the pinion. And uh, so we I took it all apart and I um, replaced the bolt and locked tight it in there and locked tight the rest of them in there. So they're good, tightened it all down, put it together, it's been fine. Came back with a noise. Okay, this is where I screwed up. It happens sometimes. This is what happened on these straps. This, these, this little round thing with all these holes in it, that's the adjuster. There's one on both sides. That, you turn those to adjust this back and forth, your lash. What I did is, when it comes in, if I'm not changing the whole thing, I just mark one and leave it. That way I don't have to guess where it goes when I'm done. Then I loosen this one all the way up and take the whole thing out. To do that, you gotta take straps off, which means, well, I shouldn't have, but I did take these off. Well, when I put it back together, I tightened this one finger tight, and I didn't tighten it all the way. Now, we've got this missing, with the wire missing. It's this, that piece keeps those from turning when everything's together. Well, that piece of wire and that bolt are missing. <laughs> which means they're probably up in that thing, which is where I'm getting metal shavings from. So I got the axles pulled and I'm getting ready to take the carrier out and the pinion out and see what we got. All right, this rider's gotta be careful not to drop this thing on the floor. Just if you if you turn it and it and it comes out this way and that's why I mark this one so that it doesn't move and I always have a reference point put it in tight over to that side and then adjust this one until it's tight all right let's get the pinion out Okay, so this is what your air, air hammer goes in. You can air hammer this thing out. And, <laughs> wow. That's still in one piece and perfectly good. Uh, just in the wrong spot. The bolt on the other hand is chewed up. Wow. Not as much damage as it could have been. I did this just to show you guys a mess up. And this was a mess up uh, for me not making sure the bolts are tight where they were supposed to be. You end up with something like this. All right, y'all. I'll let you know how it comes out on the next one.